the biblical commandments go above and beyond what many libertarians regard as sufficient for the establishment of a peaceful social order, namely the mere strict adherence to the commandments 6, 8, and 10. Yet this difference between a strict and a strict and rigid libertarianism and the ten biblical commandments does not imply any incompatibility of the two. Both are in complete harmony. The full six mentioned commandments can be recognized as even an improvement over the strict and rigid libertarianism, given the common shared goal of social perfection of a stable, just, and peaceful social order. For surely, any society of people who habitually disrespect their parents and routinely mock the idea of natural ranks and hierarchies of social authority, which underlies the institution of the family, who poo-poo the institution of marriage and cavalierly regard adultery as inconsequential, faultless, or even liberating acts, or who habitually scoff at the idea of personal honor and honesty and routinely or even gleefully engage in libeling their neighbors, um, that is, practicing bearing false witness against your neighbor, any such society will quickly disintegrate into a group of people ceaselessly disturbed by social strife and conflict rather than enjoying enduring and lasting peace. 